Hello everybody, my name is Edson and welcome back to a brand new episode on the Timeshed SMP. Today, um, I've just hopped over here, I've started cooking some fish and I just hopped over here and just went AFK just 5-10 minutes just while I went, made, go and make myself coffee and stuff like that. Grabbed all the iron that was le left over plus the couple of bits that just dropped from probably like one or two iron golems that, that dropped down. And I'm going to go and pop this in the chests, which is where I was smelting the, the food for myself because I'm almost out. So just getting a few things ready for today's episode or to the work that I'm going to do for today's episode. Uh, so it's going to be, I think today what we're going to do, we're going to do a bit more of the wall. But first I want to actually light some of this place up and light it up how I want to light it up. So there's a couple of things. Um, now I don't want to light any of this up with the, like replace the torches with the glowstone lamps. We have done a tiny bit over near the house, but that was just like a, to show people on my live streams like how I would do that. So what I want to do is I want to, because my place is sort of split off in two. So there's like the main land and then there's like this secondary land here, which is like the little desert bit there and then this bit of the farm. Now this bit of the farm and the desert bit is completely done up to the point where I will be adding maybe like one or two paths off um, that like go to the, the wall so you can like uh, walk. So you can climb onto the wall basically. So I think there'll be like one here. So let me see. There'll be like one come down here. There'll be like one that goes diagonally like that. And there'll be one that goes across like that. Um, so there'll be about three. But what I want to do today is go through all of the paths and add as many glowstone lamps as I can. And I think we should be able to cover all of this place. So we should be able to, by the looks of it, Oh, why did I just do that? Why did I just do that? Where's it got? There we go. So I should be able to... What a noob. <laughs> um, so we should have about, if we look at it strategically, because all of this is done, and then if all of that is done, we should be at least well over a third closing it on half of the actual land it'll be a third of the land because i'm counting like this as a third um, so it'll be a third of the land will be lit up which is good um so what i'm going to do is oh we haven't put the iron back so let's go and see how many um how many glowstone lamps we've got and stuff like that i'll show you guys where we're going to be working and then we'll like cut to the next bit so let's see. Oh, iron is slowly racking up. I'm loving this. I've hopped into a couple of minus miners as well. Um, so that's like been a couple of stacks each time as well, which has been good. So the little bit that we have done is this bit here. Only goes down to about here um, and stops. And it just goes up to here. Uh, so we're going to do that. Now let's see how many we do have though. Now I know there's a load... There's that. Okay. Now maybe we can get, I don't know how many stacks of stoop. Oh, I just hit one of the sheps. Right, so I need to get some, uh, make some sticks as well. Which is going to be a little bit, because I don't think we've got any more cobble. I know, we've got loads of cobble over there though. We can do this. So we just need the redstone to make this into redstone lamps. We do have a load, but there we go. Sweet. See how much this can make. So we need four per stack, don't we? Four per stack. Holy crap, we do need a lot. Maybe that's enough. We'll see. <laughs> I completely forgot how much that was. It is four stacks of redstone per stack of glowstone. But then again, the amount of times I throw redstone out when I'm mindless mining and stuff, maybe soon we will start picking it up again. <laughs> I just throw it out because it's like I never seem to use it. But I suppose now I'm finally starting to use it. Okay. go grab all of this make the final stack 
that should be as good for a while like i say like we will need to go mining this isn't going to be enough glowstone to do the whole place uh nowhere near enough glowstone should i say to do the whole place absolutely nowhere near <laughs> uh it's i kind of underestimated how big i'd made this place when i was thinking oh yeah the glowstone won't be too bad and then uh, when i was like trying to work it out like dependent on how much I'd done over there and how much like space I actually had, it was uh it was not a good it was not good it was not good math. <laughs> it didn't it didn't make for good reading should I say that? <laughs> right okay so where are they? There we are. We have a fair amount a fair amount indeed. That is good. We'll pop them in there and we need to make five stacks of so we need five stacks of sticks how many is that two that's four there we are is there a place to pop we'll pop some sticks there one, two, three, four, five. Sure, that's what I just did. There we are. And oh my gosh, it's actually quite. It's a lot of levers. But they're all needed. We're going to have a buttload of torches once I pick all these torches up as well. It's going to be crazy. Right. So there we go. There's them and we are ready we are set let's do this so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to go around all of these torches in here all of the torches in these paths um, that go up there that go around there um, all those torches are gonna be replaced with glowstone lamps and when you guys join me back hopefully all of this should be replaced we may even I may even dig out the um the paths that go through the farms um and make some new paths if not we'll probably do that in the next cut so i think this cut yeah this cut will just be the the light in here and then we'll dig out some paths in the next cut and then possibly work on some of the walls so let's do it and we are done okay so um it didn't actually take too long it took about 20 minutes to half an hour to do and i was on and off hopping on in between the patreon server and and helping the the, the two admins that I've got there, Geordie and Plus, test a few things out. So I was like, I was on and off for like a couple of minutes as well. So really probably only took me about 15 to 20 minutes. This one was relatively easy. Um, it didn't do too, well, it didn't take too long. Um, I think I want to add some dead bushes um, along here. So we're going to go and try and get with them when it gets to daytime. Because as you can see in these paths, we have grass, um, which obviously works out but here it's not we don't really have anything so I feel like the dead bushes would work and I can see like some already over there but obviously it's midway through the night and I don't really want to head out too much like just yet especially when I can show you guys all of the other things so we've lit up all around here some of this was already lit up we've lit up over here and the main thing that we had to do was this side path that goes around the left um, and then this path that goes through the center as well and obviously all of the little nooks and crannies that are sort of like hidden that we didn't really see and oh there we go um yeah and all, all, all of the sort of like nooks and crannies so like when like you come over here there's like a few i've put some put some behind here i've done some like over here and just all those like little tiny areas that like we may have missed some I may actually pop another one here. So let me do that. There we go. Um, so just those sort of areas that where we're just like we're just popping like a few in here and there, and hopefully it's. I still, yeah, we definitely want a few more here as well. So let me just let me just add them in. So I may even like see more areas later on that I want to add a few in. But I feel like I've covered everything that I need to um, all through there as well. Um, so essentially, like I said, that like third of the map that I showed you guys is now all complete, which I think looks good. Um, now, obviously, we just need to build the wall around the outside and that'll all be good. 
Um, like if you compare it, I don't know. Like if if we go on this bridge, and you compare the two, like the 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 difference is massive. Like you compare, I know you can't really get a big grasp of it. I mean, you can do if you see like this. Like look here, we haven't done the path. You can just see torches all the way through, which is not so good. Then you look here, you've got lamps, and it's a lot more flat. There's not things sticking out. It doesn't look a bit. It looks like it's the right thing now. I don't know. It looks good. I like it. So what we need to do is when it gets to daytime, uh, go and harvest a few of these dead bushes, add them to the paths um, over there into that mini desert we've got. And then I'm going to create three paths, one path off. Oh, I thought I destroyed a thing then. One path uh, that goes through here. Another path which goes diagonally here. And then it's going to like straighten up and go down here. And then we'll have, I think, another path which goes diagonally off here, and then it'll straighten up and then like go down here. I think that I think they're, they're the three. It's roughly around there that we're going to do them. So it's going to be those three paths, and then we're also going to have a load of dead bushes um, on this path, which makes it look a little less bare as such. So let's do it. Another progress update. So I hate grass it takes way too long to grow and i freaking hate it it's still not fully grown i've gone and grabbed like silk toast a few pieces of grass place them along the line and stuff there's still some that are waiting oh, it's waiting ages for them to grow so um this may be the final progress update because i'm going to actually do this with you guys watching um and we'll just see how long it goes and see how much time we've got left at the end and I, I really like how I've split this up now. I feel like it, I don't know, if we if we head up a little bit. I, I feel like this split up a little bit more has actually made it look even better. Like we've got this one now that goes through here. We've got that one that goes through there. Then we've got another one that goes through there. And I think on the maps, that's just, it's going to look so much better. I love it. So I'm really liking that we've got those three paths, and obviously those will be three more entrances onto the um, the wall itself. Uh, right, so I'm going to try and pick blocks that haven't grown grass yet. I mean, sometimes we're not going to be able to, but if we try and pick blocks that haven't grown, grown grass yet, if there are any near, it's going to help us in the long run. There's no real centre ones that are doing that, which kind of sucks, but I will. So it, as you can tell, like it doesn't actually take that long to do these paths, like, as long as you've got all the materials and everything. It's just the fact of how much glowstone I actually need to complete this place and do this path like everywhere. Oh, damn it. Unless I do stuff like that, obviously. <laughs> Gosh darn it. Um, so I need to sort of say as well, like I was going to be doing the Seven Wonders of Time shot idea um, after this place was complete, which obviously, as you guys can tell, is actually getting a lot closer with each day. But I think I finally decided not to do that. It's not that I'm not going to do it. It's that I've got a lot more, a lot of other things that I want to do instead. Um, like there's a lot of a, a lot of community projects, a lot of um, collaborations, a lot of um, sort of like other builds that I want to do for the server on the server, and hopefully, I don't know. In the near future, we will hopefully do the Seven Wonders of Time shot, but not just yet. So yeah, that's that. There we go. Let's go in there. So that's that path done. That should be alright. Maybe we can go back and do a little bit more bone mill later on, but hey ho. Um right, so let's go on to the next one. I think these two should be relatively quick. Simply because they're not actually too long. That one's really short as well. There we 
go. Oh, god damn it. Okay. Um, and yeah, like, I've got... I can say some of the community projects that I'm going to be doing. But I don't really... I can't really say... Well, I could. But, oh, god damn it. Every time. <laughs> I could, but I don't really... Like, some of them I want to sort of, like, leave until I do the projects. Even though, like, there'll be multiple episode projects. So, like, as soon as I tell you on the first episode... Or as soon as you start watching the first episode, you'll know what the project is. I'm going to keep the idea... A little bit stunned for now. I've, I've, I think I've said most of them on the on my live streams, but who knows how many people are actually listening and remembering and stuff like that. But there's some good ideas, and most of the ideas when I was giving them on the live streams, most of the people that were watching seem to like what I had planned or the ideas that I had. So hopefully, the fellow timeship members like them as well, and everything works out and it all looks amazing and and works and all of the community projects. Are just gonna work hopefully anyway <laughs> we'll soon see uh so yeah there um that's gonna be for like when we've done this place i'm not entirely sure how much more i want to do on camera here because i mean like, like i say like each episode now is just going to be step by step of building the wall um i'd like to do the q a episode that i've had planned for ages but I don't really know how much time, like, I can't really dedicate a lot of time to just working on the wall and just the wall. Um, I'm not that far ahead of time chat episodes. Like, I don't record time chat episodes really far in advance now because of, like, I want everything to be very current for the live streams. So, like, the one series I never record really far in advance now is time chat. Um, so it's really difficult for me to do the wall and sort of, I don't know, then do the Q&A after. Uh, we are going to do the Q&A and all those questions that you guys asked on the Reddit are going to be at, like answered. It's just a matter of when. <laughs> it will be It will be happening though. So don't worry about that. Right, okay. So that is now done. If we go and grab... I think I can probably update them. We're going to see how that works. Oh, I, I completely forgot to say. Yeah, we've done that. So all of the dead bushes there. I think there's just around half a stack. Um, worth of dead bushes, which I think really works with this. So we've got a load of dead bushes there. Um, it'd be awesome if they could have, I don't know, something else that like, because you've got grass for grass, haven't you? But sand is very, very, very flat. But then again, that is kind of what sand is. <laughs> it forms to the shape of the land, doesn't it? So I feel like, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> right, so let's go and pop. I see what don't I? So that. Trying to think what don't I put in the chest over where do I put lily pads? I think they're in the fishing hut. Torches. No, we can pop torches over there. So the rest of it can head over here, I think. Then we can hopefully update the maps and everything will look awesome and you guys will love it. Let's try and pop all of this away. There we go. Of course, dirt in there. Torches, all of them. Pop some glowstone there as well. They can go in the fishing hut. We'll leave them just for now. Right, let's go and get these these uh, maps and see how, how good this looks on the map when we've updated it. I'm hoping it looks good. I can't wait till we get the turnip so we can actually fill that little bit of the field in as well. Where is the first? It's really like a struggle to get the first map. But once you've got it, it's not too bad. There we go. So if we go and stand in the centre. If we go and stand in the centre of the field, we should be able to update all the maps. Without moving too far. Here we go. This will look good. Oh, I can't get over. I need to get like a really good thumbnail of the the, the field somewhere in the field anyway for the uh, for the actual thumbnail itself. I really need to get a good shot. 
I'll work on that after the episode while I'm rendering it out and stuff. Okay. So. Let's see. Updated. 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 Oh my, that looks amazing. All those paths going through. It's this one where you can really see it. Oh, it looks so good. This, this land. I'm so proud of this land. So it's going to be so awesome when this is actually done. And like, obviously we're working on the other parts, like the other ideas that I've got, the other episode ideas, all the other build ideas that I've got. But like just being able to come back here, everything being done and just like gathering resources and just doing that. Everything is here for me. Like whatever I need, I can get it here. Nothing I can't get here. It's great. Where's the... Got that map gone. Oh, it's a main Oh, okay. <laughs> I was looking for it. There we go. And that. That's looking awesome now. I mean, it's not like it wasn't before, but it's looking really good now. Whoa. Is there not a... I think there isn't a... lily pad on that we'll go and have a quick look um so yeah thank you so much for watching this episode hopefully you guys have enjoyed oh my it's been like 22 minutes almost hopefully you guys have enjoyed um the process of adding some more paths for the actual bits of the wall we will need to add more paths around the base as we do more of the wall but obviously this was the next bit of the wall that we were going to be working on so this is what we needed to do and hopefully you guys like the all of the de design choices i've just done and hopefully you're liking these episodes we are getting quite a bit of work done like i said i'm not entirely sure how many more episodes i'm going to have of this this base itself um, but hopefully it all goes good and you guys you guys like it and everything so yeah thank you so much for watching i have no idea where this where this thing was it was somewhere anyway <laughs> i'm gonna have to end here so thank you for watching hope you guys have, uh, enjoyed this hopefully i can find out where this missing lily pad is in this massive field um and if you have enjoyed this make sure you leave it a like make sure you leave it a comment subscribe if you're new and as always i'll speak to you all soon take care